The Kenya College of Accountancy University is the first private university in Kenya to honor Professor Ngugi Thiongo. Professor Ngugiwa Thiongo is currently a distinguished professor of English and comparative literature at the University of California. Born in 1938, Professor Ngugiwa Thiongo's youth was a British settler's colony. The year 1977 forced dramatic turns in Ngugi's life and career. His first novel in 10 years, Petals of Blood, was published in July 1977. The novel painted a harsh and unsparing picture of life in neo-colonial Kenya. And we produced a play called Gaika Deda in Ikuyo. It was very, very popular. Uh, later, it was translated into English as No matter when I want. Okay. But the Kenya government of the time, an African government, stopped the place on November 16, 1977, and I myself, three months later, was arrested and put in a maximum security prison. That was on December 31st, 1977. Decolonizing the Mind is a book that has won Googie recognition all around Africa and helps set the African culture on track. The thoughts which I developed while in prison were the thoughts which became the book Decolonizing the Mind. His contribution in the literature world has been recognized globally. He was nominated for the Nobel Prize. Though he did not win, his work still stands strong in the minds of many African nations. What I really appreciate and have appreciated is the knowledge that so many people in the world think my work is worth of that prize. Even more, I'm so grateful, really grateful, and I say thank you to all Kenyan people because every year I can feel the sense of uh, expectation in Kenya as a whole, you know, and to me, that's in some ways more of a gift to me or more than the material act of the prize itself. Yeah. Gugi is a pioneer writer and thinker in the continent of Africa. Now he's gone broad, he's now one of the best in the 21st century thinker and writer. KCA University is the first private university in Kenya to honor Professor Ngugi Wathiongo as a literature giant. No institution in Kenya, including government, has acknowledged the work that Ngugi is doing. Ngugi is acknowledged everywhere with all other universities in the United States and the rest of the world. And this will be the first uh, institution in Kenya to, us, uh, to do that. The students were more than happy to be in the presence of a man who has influenced African governments and has inspired many in the art fraternity. I've been reading books since now, until now. Oh my, you are a great inspiration. As the new department kicks off here at KCA, hundreds of students now have a basis of inspiration and the sky is the limit.